day four. We're about to begin day four here at the Extreme Sailing Series. John Casey with Sydney Gavinet. Um, this isn't quite like racing across oceans, is it? Uh, no, not quite. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. It's uh, well, it's 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 great. It's good fun. Uh, I learn a lot, uh, and it's difficult, but it's really, you know, really, really, really cool, and I'm. I'm so happy I'm doing that. You know, it's a big opportunity for me because I'm relearning uh, one side of sailing, and it's uh, just by doing that I'm I'm a better sailor. So for this, it's very good. Of course, you're you're no stranger to multi hulls um, with all the the long distance stuff you've been doing, but the teamwork is a little bit different here on these boats. Uh, can you explain a little bit how you guys have been um, running your teamwork on the boat? Uh? Well, it was about first to, to, to build a team. Uh, I'm sailing on Oman Air, and Oman Air is part of Oman Sail, which is an organization in Oman. And uh, one of the ideas of Oman Sail is to promote uh, Oman uh, for tourism, but also to integrate the Omanese. So they, they, they build a, a group of people, a group of sailors. So when I got on the boat, I knew that I was sailing with Nasser, who's sitting over there, the barman. Uh, and then we had to find two persons to come between us. And uh, so then uh, I didn't want another French just to make sure that by communication we would not isolate uh, Nasser. Yes. So then I went with uh, David Carr, English, who did sail with Oman uh, sail before, but I didn't know him. Uh, and then I took uh, Kinley Fowler, who was sailing with Torvar Mirski, mm -hmm. who was sailing on the second boat of uh, Oman Sail. On the wave, yeah. On the wave, yeah. And uh, that's how we, we built the team. But we are all, uh, so we are all um, new in our position. Even David Carr is new in the trimming position. He was a barman. And it's, uh, you know, to, to the way I built this team was I thought we could connect well together, which happens sometimes it did happen in Istanbul uh, yeah. but it's a uh, it's it's a big big process to to yeah to connect all the people it's very high level uh, fleet uh, the good boats are becoming even better <laughs> <laughs> so it's getting <coughs> I think it's getting almost more difficult to penetrate the top five of the of the fleet uh, but it's very this side of the of the job is very 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 interesting you know to to to, to do your own job uh, in order to let the other one do his own job well as well and to and to interpenetrate each area as well it's very 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 interesting right there's a lot of jobs to do on the boat and they all have to get done at a certain time yeah. so it's not always um, do your job but sometimes you have to go along yeah. and, and do someone else and you also have to stay in your own job so you don't disturb the other guy uh, and when all this is working well then the confidence is building and confidence is very big because all is happening in a, you know in a ten of a second so you need to be absolutely confident to have the r right reaction and that's that's what is uh, that's what we're lacking at the moment on the boat it's this confidence so we can react in any condition and there's so many situations so so different so you know and it's always so tight yeah yep. so we've been many times very close to to do a good uh, top mark uh, rounding and finally being uh, ending up in a big uh, shit <laughs> <laughs> well it's hard to put the boat in those super tight conditions without you know doing it all the time yeah no and you know every every situation is like like many times you couldn't put your fingers between two boats so it's uh it's tight it's fast but that's why it's uh it's so nice your partnership with oman doesn't stop here um you do uh, a lot as more far as i know no <laughs> and, well tell us a little bit about your other project with oman well, it's just uh, at the moment it's just a project. It's not official, but I can still uh, speak about it as a project. Uh, it's to, it would be it would be to go uh, sailing MOD 70. MOD means multi one design, 70 70 feet. So it's a new class uh, starting uh, by a Swiss guy, uh, and and I saw the boat. It's pretty good they are very simple you know it's really one design everything uh, from the sails to the hull to the ropes when you buy the boat you buy the boat with the the ropes and you know the the cover a spectra cover exactly at the same place so it's absolute one design like if you would buy a hobby cat and the circuit is uh, around europe circuit every year a transatlantic every year uh, the first transatlantic will be new york to uh, to brest in france 
with the prologue in Newport. So I think that's very, it's great to bring the multi hulls to, to the Americans, yeah. uh, especially Newport, because Newport is, a, is one center of sailing uh, in the US and it will show, it's a very different uh, sailing you have in America. We, we have uh, sailing with sponsors, you have sailing with the uh, owners Yes, and many of them are uh, are in Newport, so it will be great to bring this fleet in uh, in Newport to to, to show uh, could be good to inspire uh, some of the owners to to join the, this fleet. And then every three years, there's a round the world race, round the world tour, really, uh, which is a uh, round the world but through the canal Suez and Panama, and with uh, a bit like the Volvo, you know, with uh, inshore races in every stop, and then a leg. It looks like we're gonna have more of this stuff. You know, the bigger boats, but it's great to have you guys come over to the States and show us because we really need that help over here with the multi hulls and just sailing in general and how they're great billboards, you know, great marketing tools, and uh, we need to start to understand and, that. And, and we need uh, Americans to, co to join as well to, to, to make it more bounding. And it's now that the America's Cup is also on multi hull, I think it's the, you know, the timing is finally good to to join, uh, to make one world of sailing instead of different world. I agree. Well, good luck today. Great Thank interview. You. Thank you very much Thank for you. your time. All right. Oman Air, Sydney Gavinet.